What is good, everyone? Welcome live to MDT Live, episode number seven. We are just out of money in the bank and vindication. We're set for an exciting night of action here, packed out in the MDT arena. I am Trey with my brother, as always, as your commentary team. And it looks like our general manager, Eric Bischoff, is back with us after a time of absence. This is very exciting to see that healthy. That is not assaulted. You know, he, the last time we saw him was after he was assaulted by Randy Orton before blackout. So now, so now he is finally back, and it is good to see him, and I'm sure he'll have some good things to tell us here tonight. Oh, it looks like the rated R superstar and the former MDT champion has some words for the general manager, Eric Bischoff. I don't think Edge likes that, Brett. I think he's coming down to the ring. I'm going to kick some ass. Oh, man. And it's the new MDT champion, John Cena, making his way down. Very exciting news indeed. The MDT Championship will be on the line in our main event between John Cena and Edge in an Extreme Rules match. Hell yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, coming up next, though, we have Randy Orton in singles action. Do not know his competitor, but we do know that Randy Orton is out next. What is good, everybody? It is Trey from My Damn Toys telling you to go ahead and hit that subscribe button and turn on the bell for all notifications so you never miss an MDT upload. Our next pay-per-view is sold out coming up in a few weeks, so you don't want to miss it. Welcome back to MDT Live as we are set for singles action, and it looks like Randy Orton's competitor is going to be King ne Neville. Neville, the king of the cruiserweights, making his way to the ring. From Newcastle, England, weighing in at 194 pounds, he is the king of the cruiserweights, Neville. As we know, Neville was a part of that Money in the Bank ladder match at Money in the Bank for MDT Live. He obviously fell short in that matchup, and his opponent tonight, Randy Orton, was also a member of that Money in the Bank ladder match. Making his way to the ring from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 250 pounds, he is the fighter, Randy Orton! You know, Randy Orton and Neville both were very, very close to capturing that Money in the Bank briefcase. However, they did both fall short. Both of them were very involved in that matchup, doing very high spots off the ladder. There was a bunch of interactions between RKO's the two. everywhere. Literally everyone was hit with an RKO. Randy Orton actually started the matchup with an RKO to Neville, and it looks like we got singles matchup right here between the two. And here we go, ladies and gentlemen. They're tying up in the middle of the ring between Randy Orton and Neville. This should be an interesting matchup before. They have never crossed paths here in MDT just yet. Oh, looking for the RKO. Oh, uh, Neville gets out of it. Very nice quickness there by Neville. 
Oh, and a spinning heel kick right nice. into the midsection of Randy Orton. Oh, and a Boom. toe kick straight to the face. Oh, and another one. He finishes him off here. And Neville's very quick. You know, he may be very strong, but he's quick as well as he lands the drop kick there to Randy Orton. It looks like Randy Orton's going to roll out of the ring here to catch a break after that drop kick. Oh, look out. Uh, oh, what's Neville thinking right here? Oh, my oh, God. Wow. The springboard shooting star press to the outside. My God, we get a show right in front of us here. Jeez. As Neville's trying to get back to his feet. I can't believe Neville pulling out the shooting star press off the springboard as he throws Randy Orton back inside the ring here. Randy Orton trying to get back up to his feet. And it looks oh, like we're looking for another. Another springboard action here from Neville. Oh, Ooh. he comes up empty there on the drop kick from the top. High risk, high reward. Yeah, low reward right there, Brad. He totally missed as Randy Orton going to tee off on Neville now with a couple shots. My goodness. Just giving it into Neville as he walks him into the corner now. And another vicious uppercut from the Viper. He's in the corner now. Another shot God, from the Viper. Giving it to him. Totally giving it to him here. Oh, I think he's looking for that hanging DDT off the ropes. Oh, he's got him got up the there. Up. Oh, oh, goodness gracious, alive. This could do it. He could win the matchup right here. And Neville stays ah. alive with a kick out there. I thought for sure that guillotine DDT, as I call it, because it's just like your head goes straight into the canvas. My goodness. As Randy, Randy's looking for the RKO right here. Oh, ah. oh he came up Pushed empty. Him Very nice reversal by Neville here. Oh, he's looking for that driving drop kick again off the... There it is. Nails it right there. Neville making it back to his feet now. Oh, standing shooting star press. Sick. Looking for the cover. Oh, and a power out by Randy Orton. It's going to take more than that to put away the Viper here tonight. Oh, oh, and a big drop kick from the Viper to Randy Neville. Randy with a drop kick of his own. Very nice reversal there by the Viper here as Neville escapes to the outside. Oh, he better look out. Here comes Randy. Oh, oh and a big clothesline to the outside from Randy Orton here. Uh oh, I think you know what he's thinking. Oh, the oh. back suplex onto the barricade there to Neville. You know that's going to hurt the spinal Absolutely. cord. Absolutely. Randy throwing him back inside the ring here. May go for the cover as he gets inside, climbing up on the ropes. It looks like Neville is getting back to his feet, though, as Randy also getting back into the ring. Oh, what a super, super kick. kick right to the face of Orton. And it looks like... Neville is going high risk right now, oh, Brad. He's man. climbing the turnbuckle. It looks like he's going to look for a high risk maneuver here. Careful. He goes for the red arrow. Oh, oh my, my God. God. RKO. He reversed the red arrow into the RKO. My God. Jesus. Neville looks to be out. And Randy Orton. Incredible. With the RKO out of nowhere defeats Neville. I did not think that. The Viper could get back on his feet and hit that RKO out of nowhere. My goodness. What is good, everybody? It is Trey from My Damn Toys telling you to go pre-order Elite 61 and Elite 60 over at Ringside Collectibles. Use the promo code MDTOYS. You will save yourself 10%. Really cool set. Cannot wait to get my hands on these figures. Elite 60 with Elias is coming out as well, so go over there and check it out.
So it looks like Dean Ambrose pleading for a matchup here from Eric Bischoff. So we don't know who he's going to be fighting here, but it looks like Dean Ambrose... Doesn't matter. He's got to prove himself. He's weak. He does have to prove himself. The Shield made that known. Seth Rollins and Roman Reigns chilling right there in the backstage area made it known that he would have to prove himself here tonight as he looks to do so here. He's not even coming to the crowd. Brad just right to the down the ramp to the ring. And I guess we're going to find out who he's got in action here tonight. He's ready. Oh, oh it's my God. the phenomenal AJ Styles is Dean Ambrose's opponent. I wonder what is going through the head of Dean Ambrose. Jesus. Making his way to the ring from Gainesville, Georgia, weighing in at 218 pounds, he is the phenomenal AJ Styles. Well, Bischoff said it wouldn't be easy. He couldn't promise anything, and AJ Styles is the fact of that. It's, oh, my, oh my God. God! Here comes Dean Ambrose diving through the ropes to take out AJ. He's in very aggressive mode right now. Definitely not scared of this opponent. Definitely not. Brad, he's trying to take it to AJ Styles as he ducks up underneath here. Oh, hey, hey, kick. Overhead kick to the skull by AJ Styles here. Oh, and a Ooh. kick to the chest there. Here comes AJ Styles off the ropes. Look at that sliding phenomenal forearm there. there Very is. nice. Very nice by AJ going for the quick cover. Gets a quick one count as Dean Ambrose kicks out of it. Is he going into the corner here? Ooh, and a Ooh. stiff forearm from AJ. And a big chest slap from AJ. And another. Another, another big chest slap from AJ. Is AJ bringing it straight to Dean? He's definitely going to have to prove himself here in this matchup. Good shoulder thrust into the corner. AJ's just taking it to Dean Ambrose another right chop. now. With another chop there. Oh, here comes. Oh, it looks like Dean Ambrose trying to gain the advantage here as he reverses the Irish whip and throws AJ into the corner. Trying to get some offense in. Oh, and a kick. And another kick. And another kick. My goodness, just taking it to Dean Ambrose. Good. AJ Styles just stomping a mud hole in him here as Dean Ambrose makes his rounds. Picking AJ Styles back up into the corner here and his own Irish whip into the corner. Strong one at that as AJ backs into it. Oh, here he comes. Ooh. Oh, and he stiff arms right into the freaking turnbuckle. My goodness. Oh, AJ looking for the cover real quick. And Dean Ambrose powers out. Not enough to put Dean away. You know he's going to be fighting like hell so that his brothers do not get disappointed in him as a stiff punch to the chest here as he's backing him into the ropes. Another reversal by AJ Styles of the Irish whip. Here comes Dean. Whoa. Ducks under the clothesline. Oh, he, he takes out he takes out AJ Styles and he just starts, oh, he's wailing on him. A more aggressive style of Ambrose here in this matchup. Absolutely, he's got a ton to prove. He's got to prove himself to his brothers. Here comes AJ Styles. Oh my goodness, and a big clothesline over the top rope as it knocks AJ Styles to the outside. On oh, Dean Ambrose maybe thinking suicide uh -oh. dive like he was at the beginning of the matchup. Here he comes off the ropes. Oh, oh. a big forearm from AJ Styles knocks Dean Ambrose unconscious. AJ in the ready the that time. He was prepared for it that time, Brad, you're right. Oh, it looks like he's looking for the phenomenal forearm. Look out. Oh, he gets kicked oh, in the sternum. Oh, he's looking for the dirty deeds. Oh. Can he get it? He can't ah. get the dirty deeds, my goodness. And a stiff Ooh. forearm to Dean. Oh, lunatic lariat from Dean. Dean takes out AJ Styles. He's still going back and forth here as it looks like Dean's going for the dirty deeds again. He still he can't, get it. He can't land it. Oh, he oh, loads it, it up. Oh, AJ slips, slips out of it. Out. Oh, and a stiff kick to the sternum. Oh, he's loading him up. Oh, no. Oh, he's going for the Styles Clash. Oh, he lands it. And AJ wow. Styles defeats Dean Ambrose. What is next for Dean Ambrose? What is his Shield brothers going to say about that loss right there, Brad? Another L.
What is good, everybody? It is Trey from My Dad and Toys telling you to leave us a nice, long feedback review in the comment section below. You know, it really helps out the show. It really helps out the channel. If you will, you know, leave your thoughts. What's your favorite feuds, your favorite matches, everything that's going on in the company right now? Let us know down in the comment section. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time for main event action. Extreme Rules match for the MDT Championship between Edge and John Cena. Making his way to the ring from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 241 pounds, he is the Rated R Superstar, Edge. It looks like Edge is fully prepared for this matchup, Going Brad. old school Raven style. He's got the shopping cart full of weapons of all sorts, and it looks like he's unloading them in the ring already. He's already thrown the whole shopping cart inside the ring. He's prepared for this matchup, Brad. My goodness. And it looks like Edge is hella focused here tonight, Brad. I guess he's wearing that T-shirt for extra protection here, but here comes the MDT champion. Making his way to the ring from West Newberry, Massachusetts, weighing in at 251 pounds, he is the MDT champion, John Cena. And here comes the MDT champion sprinting down the thing, and here comes Edge. He's got a kendo stick waiting on him. Oh, he's ready. Oh, he ducks it. Oh, and Cena teeing up Ooh. on Edge, not wasting any time here. He's still got all of his gear and the championship around his waist. Oh, look at that. He uses the hat as a... Ah. <laughs> Oh, he got his ass. John Cena coming out hot here in this matchup as he finally is able to take his championship and gear off. As Edge resting here on the side of the ring here. Oh, and a little neck drop Ooh. onto the ropes there. You know, it's going to burn the throat of Cena. As Edge here. Oh, he's got that Good. steel tray. Oh, and a sliding Ooh. kick to Edge. Knocks him down to the ground, and John Cena's on the offense again. Oh, he fights him off here. Edge with a stiff punch. Oh, he's got that, he's got that dinner tray. tray. Oh, oh, right in the skull of John Cena, my goodness. He teed off on John Cena's skull, and oh my God, that it looks... Cart. He's using the shopping cart as a batting ram. Oh, Lord, look out, John. Oh, and here comes Edge right down the ramp with that shopping cart, look my out. goodness. Oh, oh my, my God. God. Crushes the sternum of John Cena with that shopping cart. Sternum, lungs, ribs. Imagine if the cart had been full. My God, it would have crushed John Cena more than it already did. And it looks like Edge now is using this time to unload a bunch of chairs into the ring now. As he's tossed a ton of chairs into the ring. And it looks like he's going to be setting up some sort of mechanism with a chair in the ring. He's starting with a one as he gets his setup. Going here, John Cena finally alive on the outside. And it looks like he's got a row of chairs here Edge plans on using in this matchup. Now clothesline to John Cena on the Ooh. apron. John sent back outside. So he's back on the outside, but here comes Edge with some momentum sliding down. Oh, and a kick Ooh. straight to the face of John Cena as Edge using this time. He's gonna looks like he's gonna grab John Cena and throw him back inside the ring here. I'm guessing he's going to try to use these chairs. Hey, he's looking for the spear here. Oh, and John loads oh. him up. Oh, he loads him up for an AA. He's got him up on his shoulders. Oh, it looks like he's going to dispose of Edge to the outside. Good God. My God, he fell forever. That what was a such bump. a far fall. Jesus. My God, Edge's back has got to be broken. He fell forever, it seemed like. As John Cena throws him back in the ring, I'm sure he's going to look for the quick cover here in this matchup. Is he going to retain the MDT Championship? And Edge ah. powers out. I don't know how he had the strength to power out of that. Good. John throws him into the corner here as he's wailing on him now. Loading him up on the top turnbuckle. Oh, and he loads him up. Oh, he's loading him up again. Lo looking for another AA. Edge fighting back. Edge is fighting out of it here. Two elbows. Oh, and Edge going to dispose of John Cena out to the outside as he flips over the top. 
And here comes Edge on the chase. He's directly behind him now. Oh, jumping that, that wrench. wrench. Oh, and he kicks him square before he can hit him with a wrench. Oh, oh my God. Jesus. Execution. Execution to the steel tray on the freaking ground. My goodness. Brutal. Edge going to look for the cover here. We're going to have a new MDT champion. Oh, and a power out by John Cena. The willpower of Cena to kick out there after that execution. Oh, it looks like he's finally going to oh, use Lord. the chairs here. Looking for the suplex. He can't get Cena. Oh, the strength of Cena. Oh, oh my God. God. He freaking launched him all the way outside Jesus. the ring. My God. Goodness gracious, Edge has got to be smashed in half. He's dead. He landed through a guitar, a table, the ambulance door. I mean, my goodness. I'm sure Cena's going to be looking for the cover. Here's he slides back inside the ring. Oh, my God, is that Randy Orton? Oh, wow. Oh, and an RKO to John Cena. RKO out of nowhere, Randy Orton. Jesus. Randy Orton is here. Why is he here? He's flipping John Cena over. Oh my God! Edge is gonna no. Edge is gonna win the MDT Championship. Edge on ah. Cena powers out again. Randy Orton can't believe it. Oh my, oh God. my God! It's Rob Van Dam, Mr. Money in the Bank. Is he is he gonna cash in his contract? There he is. Jesus, we got people everywhere. He's making his way down the ramp. I I don't know if he's going to cash in. It, oh, my God. Randy Orton's oh, watch out. off to the side there. I don't think he sees him here. He comes out of nowhere. Oh! And an RKO to RVD. Jesus. He takes out Mr. Money in the Bank so he can't cash in the contract. Oh, look at him. He's, he's putting him in the buggy. He's disposing of the trash, Brad. He's taking the money God. in the bank. Mr. Money in the Bank and his contract. And he's literally transporting him out of the arena so that he can't be involved in this matchup. Oh, John Cena's back oh, alive! No, watch out! Oh, he's loading that job! Oh, he's loading that job! Oh, the chairs! Oh, the chairs, Jesus! Oh. And he crushes all the chairs. My goodness, only two remain here as John Cena goes for the cover. And he retains oh. the MDT Championship. John Cena is still your MDT champion. He evades Mr. Money in the Bank. He evades Randy Orton. And most of all, he evades the rated R superstar Edge. Randy Orton was absent. And, and we will see you guys at episode 8.